Geometry Construction Project by Jeff Welton and Matt Wrigley. To copy a segment, you draw a segment and measure it with your safety compass. Then draw another segment to be the same length. To copy an angle, you draw an angle and make an arc with your safety compass. Measure the arc. Now make a straight line and make the same arc and another straight line and now you've copied an angle. To make a segment bisector, you make two arcs on the line and connect where the arcs meet. To bisect an angle, you draw an angle and make an arc. Now at the two places where the arc and the sides meet, make two more arcs and connect the points where the arc arcs meet in the vertex of the angle. And now you have bisected an angle. To make a perpendicular bisector, you make two arcs on your segment, then connect where the arcs meet. Now you have a perpendicular bisector. To make an altitude, you draw a segment and a point that is not on the segment. Now using that point as your anchor, draw an arc that intersects the original segment twice. Now using each intersection as anchors, make two more arcs. Now connect the point where the two new arcs meet. Now connect your original points and you have made an altitude. To make a median, you draw a triangle and label it e or A, B, C. Now make two arcs using B and C as anchors. Then draw a segment from point A through the first arc connection and to the midpoint of B, C, and you have made a median. To make an in center, draw a triangle and bisect each angle. Now, where all the bisecting segments meet, is your in center. Using the in center as an anchor, draw a circle that stays inside the triangle and touches the three sides. To make a centroid, draw a triangle. Now bisect each side of the triangle. Then connect each midpoint to the opposite angle. Now where all the bisecting segments meet is your centroid. To make an orthocenter, draw a triangle. Now draw three altitudes where the three lines from the altitudes meet. An orthocenter is made. To make a circumcenter, draw a triangle and make three perpendicular bisectors. The point where all your bisecting segments meet forms a point of concurrency and a circumcenter. Using that as an anchor, you can draw a circumscribed circle. The end.